I'm sure that most of us have decided that we really want to make this time, this special time in isolation, mean something, that we want to grow. So the question is, how do you grow? Well, it takes effort. It takes discipline. Today I want to talk to you about a discipline that's really helped shape my life, and that's the discipline of memorizing scripture. A few years ago, a friend of mine called me and challenged me to uh, memorize Colossians 3 with her, and so we did it as a team together. It was really fun. I highly recommend it. Colossians 3, and uh, it's become my favorite chapter in the Bible. It starts with, since then you have been raised with Christ, set your hearts on things above where Christ is seated at the right hand of God. Set your minds on things above, not earthly things. For you died and your life is now hidden with Christ in God. When Christ who is your life appears, this is verse four, when Christ who is your life appears, you also will appear with him in glory. Something really crazy happened to me as I memorized these four verses. I remember it specifically. I was on a walk, I was by myself, and as I memorize, I just say things over and over and over again. And when I got to verse four, when Christ who is your life appears, you also will appear with him in glory. When Christ who is your life appears, you also will appear with him in glory. Wait a minute, when Christ who is my life appears, I also will appear with him in glory. When Christ who is my life appears, I will also appear with him in glory. It was like something happened to me. It was like this balloon that was getting bigger and bigger and then it burst. And I was like at a different level of understanding of what that meant. When Christ who is my life appears, I'm going to be a part of that. I'm going to share in that glory. I don't know how all that works out, but I know that in memorizing that verse, God grew me to another level of understanding. So if you want to move closer to Jesus during this time of isolation, you might want to try that. Pick a verse that God really speaks to you through and then say it over and over and over again. And who knows? He might increase your understanding, and I know you'll move closer to Jesus in the meantime. Have a great day.